Hello lovely people, today I'm going to be teaching you how to make this beautiful bag right here. Stay tuned. Welcome to Ayaba Creations. On this channel, we learn how to make simple beaded crafts. Don't forget to support our channel by subscribing, liking, and sharing our videos. Let's begin. Materials include sugar beads, the acrylic plate, and then scissors, beading thread 0.8 mm. So, first, we we'll just have to peel the surface of a little. So, as you can see, I'm not peeling everything now because I don't want to make the surface of the plate dirty after I finish my project so I'll just peel the parts where I need to bead that is the holes and then I'll start beading first thing I'm going to do is pass the beading thread through the very first hole as you can see and we are going to add three sugar beads on each side of the thread so Let's just see. Next, we see the remaining thread. We are going to use it to pick an intersection. In the second hole so just look at how I'm doing it here so after this then we are going to pass the beading thread through the last bead so as you can see we are passing it through the last bead at one side of the plate and we are going to repeat the same thing on the other side of the plate Next, we are going to add two sugar beads on each side. We are going to do the intersection again in the next hole, as you can see. Then you're going to pass the beading thread through the last bead again for each side of the plate. Again, we are going to add two sugar beads on each side, then we intersect in the next hole again. And continue repeating the process.
guys if you want raw materials for this project maybe the acrylic plates the beads and the line whatever you want just whatsapp this number on your screen also if you want to purchase any of our craft samples at wholesale or retail prices you can also whatsapp the same number on your screen
so we are done filling the holes and let's move on to the next step okay so i'm going to add three sugar beets and then cross with the third sugar bead to make our very first ring of four beads. Then we pass the beading thread through the next bead, add two sugar beads and cross with the second sugar bead to give us another ring of four beads. again through the next sugar bead add two sugar beads cross with the second sugar bead give us another ring of four beads and basically this is what you are going to be repeating until you get to the last bead Yeah, I'm going to pass the beading thread through the next two beads so the first one and then this is the second one then we are going to add only one sugar bead and cross with our same sugar bead to give us a ring of four beads now we are going to pass the beading thread through the next bead add two sugar beads cross with the second sugar bead to give us another ring of four beads and we continue like that Okay, I'm going to add three sugar beads. So one, two, three. And then we're going to cross with a third sugar bead to give us a ring of four beads. Pass the beading thread through the next sugar bead. Add two sugar beads and cross with the second bead to give us a ring of four beads. Then we keep repeating this process.
are just going to join so we add in just one sugar bead and then we cross with that same sugar bead Next, we are going to build the sides. First, we are going to add three sugar beads and cross with a third sugar bead to give us a ring of four beads. Then we are going to pass the beading thread through the next bead, add two sugar beads and cross with the second sugar bead to give us another ring of four beads.
Next, you are going to add three sugar beads, one, two, three, and then cross with a third sugar bead to give us a ring of four beads. So this is the process you are going to be repeating. So if you watch the video carefully from here, you can be able to understand what's going on and then you can do it yourself.
this is one half so I beaded another half of camera Now let's join the two halves together. I'm just going to add one sugar bead and then cross with that same sugar bead.
Let's make the handle for the bag.
the length when you count the sides as you see i'm counting you should get 25 The next thing is just to close it and make the handle. So we just use one bead for this. I think it's self-explanatory. So you can follow the steps 